This is the Specialty Coffee Association online training. If you've already been learning with us, welcome back. If this is your first time tuning in, make sure and check out our prior episodes, recordings, and content found on our YouTube, Yoku, and SCA.training website. The SCA represents a global community of coffee enthusiasts and professionals who are devoted to continuous learning and always improving the practices of our industry. My name is Adam Scott Carpenter, but I also go by the Chinese name Huang Peng. It is my goal through SCA.training to share with as many people as possible the incredible resources created by the SCA via six specialty coffee certifications. These include Introduction to Coffee, Green Coffee, Roasting, Sensory Skills, brewing, and barista skills. These training modules are offered in three levels of expertise, foundation, intermediate, and professional. Since 2015, I've been an AST, that's an authorized SCA trainer, with a goal to help coffee enthusiasts and professionals all get certified with the SCA. My second goal, as a self-taught Chinese learner, was to develop an easy-to-follow, engaging format for any coffee enthusiast who also wishes to improve their English language skills. Slides, videos, and recordings, PDF transcripts, and more are provided for coffee English learners to double their learning with SCA.training. If you enjoy the content, please be sure to tell your friends and anyone who you think might want to move forward in their specialty coffee or English learning adventure. Today's course content is part one coming from the SCA Barista module foundation level. I'll start off with some great theory and knowledge designed specifically around the requirements presented in both the SCA Barista Foundation written exam and the practical barista skills assessment. These two exams must be taken in person with a certified AST trainer like myself or one of those that I can recommend in order for you to earn certification for this module. When you're ready to take your exam, I'll be more than happy to make sure you get a place at our next certification event. There is so much more great content that I just don't have time to present in this lesson. For you to grasp a truly holistic understanding of specialty coffee, please consider spending more time with SCA.training and complete our other modules, Introduction to Coffee, Green Coffee, Roasting, Sensory Skills, and Brewing will teach so many things that are complementary to this lesson. After that, you'll be ready to move forward onto more advanced content at the intermediate and professional levels. After this Barista Skills Foundation theory is finished, I can help guide you to register for your Barista Skills Foundation written and practical examinations, so stay tuned. I look forward to helping you on your path to specialty coffee certification with the SCA. Thanks for being part of the SCA training cro coffee crew. Now, if you tuned into last uh, the last episode, do you remember the magic formula for amazing coffee? It's a holistic approach to our work as baristas. The perfect espresso plus silky smooth milk plus really great service equals amazing coffee. Let's remember that. The general details for our course provided by the SCA are outlined here. The purpose of this module is to ensure a foundational level of knowledge and skill is achieved to operate an espresso grinder skillfully, to produce great espresso shots, and to foam milk serving a cappuccino according to core SCA standards. Though this course can be completed in seven hours, I have found through experience that students investing one and a half to two days learning, practicing, and performing the skills have a much better classroom experience and testing result. It is recommended, not required by the SCA, 
that this course be attempted by those coffee students who have already passed the introduction to coffee training module in addition to a general coffee knowledge familiarity with espresso grinders and machines is certainly helpful for students who wish to take both the practical and written examinations all right if you speak the word espresso what impressions come to your friends or family members minds is espresso a dark strong or bitter flavor is it a small Italian coffee drink maybe with a romantic cafe atmosphere perhaps they think of a blend of coffees or dark oily roast profile or a really fine coffee grind all of these and more can be impressions of the word espresso however as an SCA training student it is our desire to align with the SCA's definition of espresso which is a method of extraction let's say that together espresso is a method of extraction I'll quote the SCA espresso is a method of preparation that takes finely ground coffee compacts it into a portafilter and forces hot water through it under pressure to make a concentrated coffee beverage now we need to understand how ex espresso extraction can be manipulated and mastered by the barista to achieve optimal extraction every time Italy is the birthplace of espresso with the earliest machine patents being filed for quote an instantaneous coffee beverage 116 years ago back in 1901 they could only pull a single espresso shot through the traditional level lever espresso machine pictured left however after further machine developments and support from the Italian government espresso's popularity spread from Italy cappuccinos became the en vogue drink for young people in England who were seeking out an alternative to the local pub culture later lattes were developed in California for Americans who desired an even sweeter and larger version of the cappuccino today with baristas all over the world preparing espresso drinks it is essential to communicate how much work goes into every cup coffee must be grown in specific locations before the fruit is harvested by farmers afterwards the fruit is transported to be processed at a mill for storage as raw coffee beans later the green coffee will be shipped to a roaster where it is roasted packaged and delivered to a cafe where those beans are entrusted to you the barista to make a perfect drink served with a smile handed to a customer the barista must realize she is the final step representing a very long coffee value chain the need for excellence cannot be overstated we baristas must first represent all stakeholders before us in the coffee industry and all the work that these professionals have invested into those beautiful beans second we baristas must prepare our beverages correctly with care and attention to the highest standards in espresso and milk quality third we baristas must communicate with our customers providing specialty coffee insight with caring service next time we're going to dig in really deep to the five interdependent elements as outlined by the SCA for making fantastic espresso as we move along we'll be looking at the knowledge and skill required by baristas to control espresso beans and blends second the barista you third espresso machines fourth the espresso grinder and fifth the water that we use in espresso preparation or extraction these five elements should be committed to memory both for your exam and for your practice and practical application of SCA standards Wow great work we've got the first lesson under our belt 
maybe you want to review, uh, feel free to scan the QR code. You can get started by following our WeChat account. You can say, hey, I'm a coffee student or I'm a coffee English student. I want to learn more. You can go to our website at www.sca.training and you can find more great resources, classes that are being offered, excellent AST trainers that we recommend. There's so much more to learn and discuss. Discuss. <laughs> it complements this material. So, to gain a holistic understanding of all these variables, the barista should stay tuned and stay plugged in. All right, a little more information. The SCA uh, specifically has 16 certified training programs. You can stay tuned and learn more on our web so website, but these five coffee modules are offered after the Introduction to Coffee class. Green coffee, coffee roasting, sensory analysis, brewing coffee, and barista skills. You can take them in three levels. So that equals 16 certified training programs that you can choose from. You can create your own path if you're a coffee roaster or a barista or you work in a trade company. The SCA has a program designed specifically for you. And SCA.training wants to be your partner guiding you through that journey. A little bit more about myself. As I said, my name is Adam Scott Carpenter, Chinese name Huang Peng. This is my family. As you can see, I'm the proud husband to a beautiful wife and father to two wonderful daughters. I'm the son of an American farmer from the state of Michigan. I call myself an entrepreneuring and creative individual. I love to solve problems and find creative solutions to help others. This program with SCA training is the product of much entrepreneuring, studying creativity after spending almost 20 years in education. I've worked over a decade in China and invested more than six years into the specialty coffee industry. Therefore, it is my hope and goal that this content is a blessing to your life and to your learning goals. If it is, please make sure to share it with everybody you know. Thanks and make sure to come back for a great SCA.training refill. I'll see you next time.